face news. Bomb threats at multiple state capitals are being investigated by the FBI. The agency considers all of them a hoax, but it adds to a string of rising swatting incidents. A uh, swatting essentially is when a, a fake call is made by a person to police reporting a made-up threat serious enough to bring out officers or SWAT teams to a location. Yeah, Kelsey Kernstein is here with the latest on this story. Kelsey, what's the deal here? Good morning. Good morning, I'm Mark and Adrian. So reports say that a mass email was sent out titled Explosives Inside of Your State Capitol, adding explosives would go off in a couple of hours. This creating fear at state capitals. In fact, around the country, Connecticut, Georgia, Hawaii, Kentucky, Maine, Michigan, Minnesota, Mississippi, and Montana. They're just some of the states that evacuated buildings while others went into immediate lockdown. News Nation's law and justice contributor and former FBI special agent Jennifer Koffendoffer explains what the motive could be for these threats. It's typically revenge or anger or them wanting to make some sort of political statement against somebody else. In other words, it's really a harassing type situation and they realize how dangerous it is. Now, this is just a part of a string of swatting calls that we've recently seen across the country. Georgia Representative Marjorie Taylor Greene and Florida Senator Rick Scott were also targeted over the holidays. Boston Mayor Michelle Wu, New York's representative Brandon Williams, and Ohio Attorney General David Yost were also swatted. Well, swatting is very dangerous, and let me tell you why. They are looking when a call comes in and SWAT or law enforcement is uh, dispatched to a particular location, and especially in a situation where it's a congressional or a senator uh, figure that's involved that's high profile. Uh, well, and it really, in all instances, they're taken very seriously. And that means that lethal force, uh, they're setting up to use that if necessary. And right now, there are no official statistics on swatting calls, but law enforcement says hundreds of swatting incidences are recorded every single year. The FBI has now created a virtual command center partnering with state, local, and federal law enforcement to, quote, track and create a real-time picture of swatting incidents. Now, the FBI is also telling people to remain vigilant. Thank you for watching. Go to NewsNationNow.com to find NewsNation on your television provider. And don't forget to click the red subscribe button below to get more of NewsNation's fact-driven, unbiased coverage.